Hello my beautiful Cancers, welcome to my channel. Today we're going to be looking into your financial forecast, career and money messages. Let's see what's coming your way. And this reading is intended for Sun, Moon and Rising signs. So if you have any of those in your chart, it might actually resonate with you. I will also leave a link up here and in the description box below. If you would like a private reading from me, you can go ahead and book your reading from there. I also want to thank you for being here and being an amazing support to the channel. And if you would like to support more, give some love. Don't forget to hit subscribe and become a member of this beautiful soul community. Subscription is free. You can unsubscribe anytime you want. Okay, let's jump into your reading and let's see what's coming your way. There is, yeah, there is a commitment actually coming. This commitment can be regarding a new job or maybe if you're going to start a new school, can be that. I see another person here with a cloak. They're pointing out from the outside, maybe within the third week. This is intended for next four weeks. Uh, they're going to be maybe showing you a path. Uh, this can be, oopsie, a mentor, someone guiding you. And there's actually tears of joy and unexpected news also coming forth, okay? I see there's a chunk of money here within the second week from another outside source that's going to show up. And also within the first week, there's uh, like a chunk of money there. Um, this can be, when I mention chunk of money, maybe you are in a situation that you're not really expecting from any resources. Uh, this can also be uh, like any maybe you're not expecting any money so that this can be a resource okay a connection um someone who's going to be a referral a ref referencing for you okay and uh, giving you a referral i see that there is actually a massive crowd that you're walking into and in that crowd, you might be even receiving an information that will lead you to this chunk of money here. There are two people discussing under it. This can be a subject of maybe an agreement or um, a situation because there's a small legal paper here coming through a contract. You are finding this resource, getting this money. But before you actually receive it, you're probably going to have some sort of negotiations with someone. And um, there's an octopus here. This kind of looks like a male figure. But also the octopus can symbolize someone who's flexible, um, multifunctional. Like this can be your energy. Maybe the attitude is required here in order for you to get this heart's desire, this contract, this financial support and um, manifestation of the money. You might have to have this flexible attitude rather than being this... Uh, you know, close minded or like um, laser focused uh, way. Okay. So with that, you're going to be actually maybe um, being like, because op octopus, I think they have like uh, eight tentacles, which symbolizes that they can actually reach the eight different places. So uh, when you have that soft, gentle attitude, this is going to give you more access to abundance. Maybe more opportunities are going to be lining up. And maybe connections are going to be like forming really fast and in a better way. And even I see like a rain is coming forward. The rain of abundance is going to start faster, fall faster on you. Okay. And uh, I see a person dancing here. Definitely towards the end of the month, you're going to be celebrating. Like I said, you're entering into a beautiful crowd. Uh, this crowd can be like a people coming together and celebrating your success with you. Another thing popped into my head is like if you're planning to go to school, maybe applying for some something like that or uh, even like another um, position at your work that requires you to learn more about certain things. And those are going to be approved, supported, uh, paid for, all taken care of. And this can also be now I'm thinking a vacation opportunity also coming your way that is all paid off. Maybe that's why you're enjoying it. You're dancing around. You're going to be having fun with it. Okay. I see in your heart there's not much of a clarity how this is going to be coming forward. That might be causing some sort of frustration within you. But at the end, you're going to see the resource. Because I see kind of like a mushroom also appearing here, which symbolizes fast growing wealth. So it is going to be coming forward and staying with you and also have the opportunity to grow okay multiply whatever this resource of wealth is 
Let's get into a plea now. If you have a question, desire, and intention, hold it in your mind. And there's a chunk of money in your heart space. There's a second desire coming with tears of joy. Your first desire is coming extremely fast, okay? You can see, like, you're going to receive a lot of good news within this next four weeks. I see that there's actually a new horizon and there's a chunk of money towards the fourth week coming forward. There's a person standing here. They have two rings. Two rings can be symbolizing double approval, double um, commitment. And um, there's also negotiations happening here. There are two fish behind you. Fish also symbolizes money. And uh, that double offer, maybe somebody's going to be doubling the offer for you so you can actually um, start working with them. Or maybe there is something, maybe a resource that you want to obtain, a house that you want to buy. I don't really see a roof here. It can be um, like an expensive, valuable item that you want to grab. Maybe you're going to be raising the offer on that as well or if you're selling something someone might be raising the offer on that as well i see number eight on in the middle of your heart eight actually symbolizes um material satisfaction okay at the end of the day you're gonna have that material satisfaction you're standing on the bag of money right here so like whatever this negotiation is number three is also present here which indicates creativity you're going to be coming up um very like extremely victorious as well as uh with the gain that you're desiring from this interaction okay i see also like a mountains on the horizon right there there is a baby cow here which indicates another resource of growth and fertility and the mountain is something good something on the horizon the goal that you have um that maybe because it's a like a mountain far far away can be something that you think it's not really possible at this time but it seems like it will become possible the impossible will be possible for you okay we have the nine of mm-hmm Okay, this came with a Capricorn energy, nine of wands. This actually indicates taking a step back, pausing, looking around. She's playing with the stars here. These are all of your wishes aligning, but uh, also maybe even uh, protecting your territory. Okay, we have the ace. Um, no, I'm sorry. This is also fire energy, seven of fires, seven of uh, nine of fires and seven of fires. This can be protecting your territory okay you're going to be given an opportunity you are wanting an opportunity but at the same time you're in a situation that you have to protect what you already created okay do not go um like leave what you have in order to get more okay just wait for your heart's desire it's going to be delivered to you because the stars actually indicate that but also if you already have something we have two sevens here seven is actually knowledge strategy and wisdom self-reflection and analyzing the situation we have the pentacles here seven of pentacles so protect what you have created already take pause and look at the maybe change your plans in order to reach your goals seven of pentacles can be maybe you wondering is this juice worth the squeeze i've been working on this thing so long am i going to get the results and this is actually a yes okay you're going to be getting the results but you need patience at this moment with the sun card here a lot of optimism, good news, and uh, the positive opportunities are going to start flowing into your life, okay? With the yellow, and we have nine of, okay, this is a shuffle deck. I don't know how this is happening right now, but which is a good thing for you. This came with the Capricorn as well. If you have Capricorn in your chart, it might actually resonate. Nine of cups is wish fulfillment. Your desires are going to be coming your way. Even if you're wondering, is it going to happen? The answer is yes, it's going to happen. It's going to come to you, okay? You don't have to worry anymore. You don't have to be uh, like thinking about the past and uh, maybe being judgmental towards the future, okay? It says you're going to receive your heart's desire. And we have the animal guardian coming forth. Trust your instincts. That's the message for you. Like if you're feeling like 
going to certain places, talking to certain people, it is telling you to do that because that is going to lead you to, to that beautiful opportunity, new financial, uh, maybe investment opportunity, a new job that will be paying much more than you can even fathom or imagine, okay? So follow your instincts. And if you're not feeling good about certain people around them, it's good maybe not to share your plans or future. This can be people at work. This can be people that are actually asking you stuff about your money. Okay, we had the lady of the lost here. You're holding a little de baby deer in your hand. You have a little owl, which symbolizes actually your uh, high intuition. We have a crow. We have um, jaguar. Gives to others treasure, life, and all its magic. Treasure, life, and all its magic. Okay, give to others. This is kind of like a six of pentacles energy here. The more you give out, well, the more you get back, okay? At this moment, this is actually the message coming forth, and I, I think it's beautiful. So if you're feeling like um, you need more, I'm not saying to give out the things that you actually need. Give good smile. Give a good compliment. Whatever that you have available. If you're giving something that will actually put, puts you in a position of feeling lack, don't do that. But compliment and smile and like good treatment that is all free that we have within us freely we obtain that so you can give that to others and that will actually connect you with the right energies in order to manifest all the diamonds all the wealth that you're desiring finally we have the truth and peace coming forth the answers will come clearly as you pause and relax trust your instincts kissed by the eternal sun the sun is right here the sun actually indicates optimism positive thinking and going after the positive experiences rather than just going falling victim to your thoughts and your past um, experiences okay all right my beautifuls that's all for today hope you enjoy your reading if you do don't forget to give this one a thumbs up and if you want to see more of these go ahead and subscribe to my channel i wish you all a magical day bye